on again like a week later I'm trying Paragon again but this time I just noticed late last night that I got an email stating that um, every once in a while that they were going to give open up like a free weekend for people to play to try the game out and they were like hey and so now we're letting you know that this is that weekend and the last day is May 8th and to boot not only is today May 8th <laughs> um, it goes on from like 1 my time till either 10 or 11 o'clock at night. I think it's 11 o'clock, which is like from 12 till 10 Eastern. So, here we go. Okay, new. I've never played a MOBA before. How would you classify, classify yourself as a player in the MOBA genre? Okay, beginner. I played a few games, but don't really understand the rules of the genre. Experience. I played a number of games and I understand the rules of the genre and veteran. I played many games and fully understand the rules and strategy of the game. I'm new. I'm the new. I am. The, I'm the noob. <laughs> Places you with all new players in Call vs. AI matches. Matches you with and against other experienced players. Okay. Matches you with against other. Okay. New. Well, I was going to select new anyway. Select the hero for your first match. Okay, I see people's names and they have easy on the top right hand corner, so I didn't know what that was. Anyway, like last week I was, I read, like not last week, but a little over a week ago I read that, you know, the free weekend, or the free beta, open beta was supposed to take place in Paragon last weekend. And I tried and I'm like, well, I just got, you know, trolled and I'm like, you know, I got I got ticked off because I was really looking forward to trying this. So gaming websites are like, oh, this is happening, and it wasn't. And I finally get the email today that it's happening for me now. All right, the abilities pretty well. Okay, I see what's going on. So these first four are recommended starting heroes. Okay, so let's see. It's a little better. Basic attack one. Growth. Okay. Gadget. Go, go, gadget. I'm going to go with one of the first four here because it mentions recommend starter hero. So, I think I will try. I'll go try Murdoch. Okay. Hot pursuit. Is this need for speed now? R2 for basic attack, R1 for shielding shot, square for buckshot, circle for static trap, triangle for devastating blast. Okay. Alright. Uh, 
play some team of four other human players of similar, similar experience and matched against a team of five AI controlled bots. If you would like to play with a friend, we recommend skipping to the home screen. You will be able to join a party with them and search for a match together. Due to the nature of MOBAs, a player cannot join matches that are in progress. Okay, I did not know that was a thing. Searching. Sure. They probably quit, my guess. They probably see me and they're like, oh god, this guy's a noob. This guy just started playing. And backs out. Okay, I actually have no idea if one can actually tell if, uh. Well, I can see my level here, obviously. But I can't see theirs. So, how do you know how experienced the players are that you're playing with? Come on, game. Search. Come on. Come on. down to two people. That's nice. I wouldn't be surprised at this point if this person leads next. Purchase boosts and the store to increase XP and reputation gain from completing matches. Cosmetic and convenience items that do not directly affect gameplay. Coins can be purchased in the store and received as random rewards for the, from the win up. Computation.
Yeah, this is starting to look flawed. You gotta sit here and wait for people to join your matches for an open... I know this is beta, but come on, I mean... If you have to sit around waiting for somebody to... For five people to join your game, well, technically four, since you would be the one waiting for them. I mean... They should have just went, okay, here's the Founders Pack. The Founders can play whenever they feel like it. But here's the open beta. Like, have it so anybody can download the game and play it that they want when they, when they want. Like, within, you know, that time period. I guarantee you, people will download this to play it. A lot of people probably look at it and go, oh, Founders Pack, I'll just wait for the game to come out. And, of course, you have to sign up to Epic Games' website, and then they let you know when you, you know, you know, <clears throat> when you can get special access to this. So, really, in my opinion, If only certain people are allowed to get access, and I didn't even know until today, because I don't check my email every day. I check it like once or twice a week. So, you know, if they just had it open, and then anybody could download it, we wouldn't have this issue. Guarantee you that. Because people will be like, oh, it's a MOBA game, I'm not going to play it. Or it's, oh, it's a MOBA game, I'll give it a try. Or, oh, it's a MOBA game. I'll definitely play that. I like participating in betas, too. There's like three or four different types of people out there. Me, I like participating in betas to help out. To, you know, stress test servers. Pr provide feedback and such. But, when you got issues like this, they should just give you an AI bot right away. Oh yeah, that's right. And MOBA rules, nobody can join a game once it's started. <sighs> well, here's the issue with that. As much as that kind of makes sense because it's more fair for, you know... Finally! Thank you! Holy snap! All right, enemy core inhibitor, ally tower, harvester, uh, harvest amber, kill enemy minions and collect them, collect from harvesters to equip more cards, okay, unlock and power, or, or wait, unlock and upgrade your hero's abilities when you level up, destroy enemy towers and inhibitors to expose their core. Okay. But that's the one, that's the negative thing about this um, open, I'm calling it open beta because I'm not a founder. That's the thing about this open beta. It's like, yeah, okay, that's great, but if you had it open to public, it would I'm more likely chance to like find people to play with. Clearly established that. that I don't understand what what does this mean 
Why is there a countdown? Do bad things happen when this thing reaches zero or what? Can this open? No. Okay. Um, alpha something? Okay. Attacking metal moon. Poison? No. White thing with axe. From the game company that brought you Gears of War presents White Men with Axes attacking you. The game. Oh boy. Ooh. Ah, I'm trying to upgrade here. Thank you very much. Um. Oh crap. 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 Thing. God damn it. 
course I have to defend the core now. Okay. Let's try that again. Can I run faster? No, nope, apparently not. This is about as quick as I run. Oh my. I don't even know how to spend the unspent power. They don't even give you a freaking tutorial on this thing. They're just like, hey, here you go. You're now fighting people. Good luck. And I'm like, oh, really? Wow, that did like nothing. Unless there's a fucking of that one guy there. I wanted the XP. first thing these guys said that made this game was that we're gonna make you care about MOBAs with this game. Oh yeah, did I did I mention that that this is gonna be the, one of the most easiest MOBAs to get into to play? It's kind of hard to prove that when you don't have a tutorial in your goddamn game. Just saying. I like how this character's basic attack is basically his strongest attack, but yet when you use your special abilities it does weaker damage. Shouldn't your special abilities do a little more damage than your... I know that's not how this character was built, but I think it's kind of stupidly built. Because your special abilities mean nothing if they don't really do much damage, right? So... You're mainly just sitting there going, okay, well, I'm going to go and, you know, make this, you know, I'm, I'm going to go and attack this guy with this special ability and not really do much damage. What's the sense of using special abilities when you can just sit there and go... You know? That, if that is your main source of firing and, and killing people with this character, it's kind of sad and pathetic. I mean, it's not your main source, but I mean, it's your main strong point. It's like, wow.
just realized I have a upgrade. Might as well upgrade that, I guess. Excellent. There we go. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Because I can target this one. Beautiful game. I'll say that much. Comparing it to Smite. I think this just beats the look of Smite. As in. Um, scenery. Just by. A teensy little bit? I mean, it's not really much to look at, but then again, Smite wasn't either. Enemy tower destroyed. This kind of gives it sort of like a Lord of the Rings feel, which I greatly appreciate. Oh, alright, excuse me, just taking this XP. Thank you. Don't need to tell me how to attack. Pick a hero, and I picked a hero, and then and then it just sent me into battle. That was it. Why can't I pick up these white things? Yeah, when I launched the game there, it logged me in, and then it asked me how new I am to to mobas. And when I selected. Um, they're like, okay, we're gonna put you in as players versus AI, and then after they put me into that, they were like, okay, just, you know, select a hero, and then that was it. Can upgrade my basic attack now? Which I just did. So I didn't realize I had two level ups. Okay.
Oh. Um, okay. I'll, I'll check it, I'll, I'll see it, like, after when this match is done. do you play as code? Take that. Even though I still don't have it. So what made you want to buy this game, their, uh, code? I know you got the, uh, starter pack. I can upgrade. Uh, I am going to go with square. That happened. Whoop. Of course I would miss.
That's where you heal. Well, time to test out the ring. up here. Uh, of course. Back off now. Damn it. Alright.
the sage. What? Okay. I thought to use the touchpad. the halfway point you probably slow down.
Destroyed? Finally. Okay, now see, I haven't come across this here, so... Paragon TV. Okay. to Paragon in 60 seconds. Oh, this is the intro to Paragon. Oh my god. They take you to a YouTube page?
guess you unlock these characters when you get higher in levels. Okay. Okay, so it says I could watch this. Now, are they going to allow me to watch this in game? Or are they going to take me to a Twitch channel to watch a stream of these people playing? Because automatically they had home intro to Paragon bring me to freaking YouTube. So. In theory, this will probably end up bringing me to, what do you call it, to Twitch. We'll see what happens. Yeah, sure. Play. Oh, nope, they actually watched, let me watch it in game. Okay. This is interesting. This is probably, I don't know. I just, I'm, I'm going to see this here. I could have watched the other video, but I'm not going to. It's bad enough. I already took like a minute and 15 seconds away from the stream or this video. So they allow me to free roam with a camera. It's interesting. This is the only map. Which sucks. Ooh, let's follow this guy.
I wonder what enemy tower is under attack. He went back to the home base. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's him. Yep. Okay. Don't know how he did that, but you know, whatever. Alpha content. I'm gonna wait and see what happens when this time limit goes down. So I've never seen this before. Well, I've seen a countdown and I had no idea what it was for, but it wasn't this, but I'm gonna check and see what this is. Oh my god. This is taking forever. Come back to it. That's the alpha content? Wow. Okay. If you say so, I guess. You got this. You got this. Come on. Yes. Congrats, guys. Pew, pew, pew. Look at that high intense action. Oh my god. Isn't this exciting? It wasn't free range cam until I hit the left stick. The power of the orb has left. An enemy 
enemy tower destroyed. Yeah. Well, that was a thing. Part of me says I don't think this is going to be a big hit on the PS4. Since it's not free to play, that you have to actually buy the game. I don't know, I could be wrong, but I just, I just, I don't know. I could be wrong. It may be popular. I just, I don't know. Well, <laughs> lol. One thousand eight hundred and seven, ten thousand fifty. Speed boost. At least there's that. No sense buying that since today's the last day for me playing. So they're gonna give me f three free wins if I spend two hundred. <laughs> An additional 100% experience from your next three match victories. Okay. That makes a little more sense. So, yeah. Man's Hero. Well, anyway, this has been Paragon by the creators of Gears of War. Um, I like that this is more of a shooter compared to Smite, but there's just something about this, I don't know, I just can't get into this. I don't know, it's not really for me. As for Smite, it's almost basically the same thing. I don't know, but I think I could play Smite a little bit more and enjoy it a little bit more than this game. But... I don't know. It just... It's not really for me. But if you have a PlayStation 4 and you don't have a PC to run this, try, try to see if you can get into the open beta. Sign up to the uh, website and look at your email, you know, daily. <laughs> I don't mean daily, but like on the Thursday of the week. You know, each week and see if maybe you get like an invite for a free to play open beta like I did. And give it a try. You know, if you like MOBA games, or if you're not sure about MOBA games, but you want to try it and you tried Smite, and if Smite wasn't really for you, and you're more of an, a shooter type of person, give this a try. Uh, but I just, I just, I don't know, like, I can't, I'm not going to say I don't recommend it, but it's just not for me. So, take it as you will. I, I just, I don't know, there's a bit much, and the learning curve seems to be you know, seems to be pretty deep because, like, there's cards involved and you gotta, like, know how to use those or when the good time to use them or or if, or if you just use them, but... I don't know. I just... I'm not really fully understanding, but then again, I could go into gameplay tips, but I'm not going to because that's going to take me out of the thing again and bring me to YouTube. So, yeah. <laughs> I wonder if you could just type into Intro to Paragon into YouTube and it just gives you this video right here. And then gameplay tips for Paragon. But anyway, this has been Paragon. Um, the next time I stream, a legit stream, it's going to be Uncharted 4. Uncharted 4, baby. Two more days. Two more days.
Well, this has been Paragon. See you, everyone.